Hi, I'm Kevin D. I'm the designer at Evergoods. Today I want to introduce our Transit Packing Cube 8 liter. Uh, during the development of this product, we explored a lot of different options and concepts for the final form. In the end, we ended up with, uh, you know, this clamshell item that's probably pretty familiar to most of you. Uh, we really just thought this was the best solution for packing. What are we talking about packing? You know, putting a bunch of stuff inside of another thing. We're calling it the packing cube. Obviously, it's not cube shaped. Uh, so to illustrate, I've got this container here. You know, I can put three of these in this box this way. Uh, there's a little space left over here. So one of, the, one of the concepts or ideas behind this is that all the dimensions are slightly different. Uh, so if I take these packing cubes and I just turn them a little bit differently, I can use that extra space and get one more packing cube in here. Conversely, if I was to say the top edge of this box is the limit to our container, um, yeah, maybe uh, these fit better in here flatly. So in order to not go over the top edge, I can, I can open this up and now I got two packing cubes in here um, not exceeding the top edge. So the point is just that the different dimensions of the finished size and the fact that it opens uh, just allows a lot of uh, finished, finished dimensions to uh, pack into your luggage. In addition, we base the dimensions on our existing products. This is half zip 22. It's got a pretty square bottom. So packing cube nestles down in the bottom easily. You could probably put another one on top if you needed two packing cubes. Here's CPL 24. Um, you could put packing cube in here, probably close this okay. Uh, if you had a bunch of other items, maybe some books and a computer, uh, it might fit better this way. Nice and flat, put another thing in the top there. So just the point here is that the, the dimensions here allow a variety of kind of layout options so that hopefully this packing cube fits inside of whatever you're packing into. Okay. Okay, so let's talk about the features of this packing cube. Uh, we got a couple of handles on the top, easy enough. We left a little slots at the sides like we do. If you wanted to tag this with information about what's inside or your name or clip your keys to it or something, fine. Um, we, we gave a little accessory pocket on the outside. I, I've stuffed cash in here before to like hide it in a hotel room. The thing I mostly use this for is I'll put like a plastic grocery sack in here so my dirty undies and stuff can go in there as, I, as I'm traveling. Uh, so we got a little accessory pocket on the outside. Uh, the textile of this packing cube is a 210D high tenacity nylon and it's, it's uh, super high density weave. So it's really uh, like tightly woven, it's really slick. It also has a silicone finish on the outside so that it can s slide in and pack with other stuff. Okay, we've got some nice uh, counter pulls here so you can open this main zip, unzip it to see the contents. These handles now are one on each side. You can pick it up like this, move it around if you need to without closing it. Easy cheesy. You can see here that inside uh, the, the zippers for the mesh here, they ride just above this main zipper. So, so we set the zippers higher up just so that this would, it kind of clears the main zipper line so that it's easy to use. Um, so we also set the zipper heads in opposition so that when they're either both open or both closed, they're at opposite sides, they don't um, run into each other. Uh, outside of that, this is pretty typical. Uh, it's, it's just a rectangular area for you to pack into. Um, we, get, we made it standard gray so you can see through it easily. In addition to the standard gray interior for better uh, visibility inside, we gave you one uh, high-vis orange puller so that you can differentiate between these two sides if you need to. Um, also, we ran the zipper line kind of like further in than, than the main zipper. You can see the main zipper ends out here and these zips fall on the inside. Uh, the goal here is that when this thing closes, that these zipper pullers are not like falling in the way out here, that the, that the main zipper line remains clear uh, from the smaller zippers because they come further toward the center. Uh, you can see that these levels are taller than the main zipper. So when I put this together, they kind of it kind of looks a little a little tight, but then as you zip it, you can see that fabric 
just pulls everything together and just makes this into a nice little football. So I think you can pack a lot in here and just the simple act of opening and closing it lends a bit of compression to make this a little smaller to fit inside your luggage. Of course, like all of our products, our logo here is an embossed piece of Velcro loop and it accepts our high-vis patches. I would recommend glow in the dark for this product so you can find it in the dark closet or hotel room at night. And this is our transit packing cube, eight liter.